Oshkosh, a bucket list trip for nearly every aviator and aviation enthusiast. After all, it's an opportunity to see just about every make and model of general aviation airplane ever created. Yet, this trip turned out to be so much more. Planning the 1100 nautical mile journey began long before the show. Deciding what to bring, where to stop for fuel, and of course, prepare for the famous Fisk arrival. The day before my departure, I loaded up the bearing, did a thorough pre-flight, and topped off the fuel tank. After an overnight in Jacksonville, to get a head start on the weather, the long journey began at sunrise. Next stop, Wabash, Indiana, 659 nautical miles away. With storms building quickly all around, the views of Mother Nature just don't do the video shot. Wabash turned out to be a great choice. Great fuel prices along with a small town hospitality. After a quick bite and a top off, Oshkosh was only 229 nautical miles away. Despite all my planning and preparation, there would be no Fisk arrival for me. Mother Nature had her own plans and Baron Pilot's first trip to Oshkosh was not about to trump her plans. Fortunately, during all my preparation, the forecast hinted this may happen. So like all good pilots, I had a plan B. And that included reserving an IFR slot into Oshkosh. From Wabash, flying north along the east side of Lake Michigan before cutting across the lake kept me out of the storms, and Mother Nature did her part to leave a perfect corridor for the arrival. After a long taxi to the GA ramp, one that felt more like a parade route than a typical taxi, I had two days to kill to see what the town of Oshkosh had to offer. With the downtown farmer's market, to restaurants and bars with an aviation theme, Oshkosh made you feel welcome and at home. With beautiful countryside, and water views. Oshkosh has a lot to offer. And then there is the air venture. A week of immersion like no other. Airplanes everywhere you look. you could ever want to see. After all, this is the week Aviation makes the biggest announcements and product launches. Hi, Launchpad Marzari for Pipistrol Aircraft and we're here with the new Alpha Electric. And what we're looking at is the future. That is the motor. The airplanes and the vendors are only half of what makes Oshkosh Air Venture amazing. What I enjoyed the most was the people. 600,000 people. 40,000 camped on the field, and everyone had an amazing story to tell. But what would Air Venture be without an air show every day?
sight of airplanes performing to their limits by day, and what can only be described as dancing at night. people I met, there turned out to be so much more. Oshkosh 2019 is already marked on my calendar, and if you've never been, it's a must-see. I look forward to reconnecting with friends I've made this year and making more memories to last a lifetime.